A lot of bicycle deaths, there have been three in the last month. Cyclist Mitchell Krasnopolar was never really big into riding his bike, till one day 12 years ago. My son Nathan was killed while riding a bicycle in 2011. Just 20 years old and in college. Sometimes cars don't see us. That's why he's riding Wednesday night in the Ride of Silence. It's a night that cyclists from all over the world get together and ride, slowly and quietly. It's silent because we want cars to be aware of us, but we want to do it in a respectful way. The first Ride of Silence started in Dallas. Now, 20 years later, there are more than 200 ride location events internationally. And one of the neat things about it is, it is the ride starts at 7 o'clock, you know, local time. So we try to cover all the time zones. So there's, you know, it's like a rolling uh, ride. Mitchell says the city is doing better with bike lanes and protected bike lanes, but he says there needs to be more along streets like 63rd Street that run east to west connecting those lanes because he says he notices drivers getting impatient with cyclists daily. It can cause somebody's death, so you might save a minute, but you've you could end up killing someone. In Kansas City, Alan Shope, KMBC 9 News.